My name is Trenton Holliday and my book is Cro-Magnon, The Story of the Last Ice Age People of Europe. So the book is about early modern humans in Europe, which is one of my areas of expertise. These are interesting people because they interacted with and interbred with Neanderthals. So it's about the last ice age when Europe was mostly grassland with mammoths and woolly rhinoceroses and all sorts of interesting animals. And I talk about the origins of modern humans, where our species comes from, and about the lives of these um, prehistoric people. The reason I wrote this book is that there's a relative dearth of books on early modern humans in Europe. In contrast, the Neanderthals, there are books written just about every year that come out on Neanderthals. I love the Neanderthals, they're near and dear to me. They play a big role in this book, but I really wanted to focus on early modern humans, homo sapiens in Europe, whom I've studied for many, many years. I wanted this book to appeal to the general public, but I also wrote it with academics in mind. So I've tried to find that fine line where if you want to read the more sophisticated parts of the book, you're welcome to do it. I've tried to make it accessible to everyone, the educated person. If you don't want to read some of the stuff that's a little more quantitative, a little less exciting, uh, I've put those sections in boxes so you, the reader can feel free to read just the parts that are a little more interesting. I've also have some fictional accounts in there that I've tried to bring to life what life might have been like for these people. I think the book's lasting contribution will be about what it means to be a member of our species, Homo sapiens, especially in light of the interactions between our species and other prehistoric human species, something that seems odd to us today our interactions with Neanderthals and another group called the Denisovans. And also, what is modern human behavior? Do we behave differently than these other groups? And in this book, I make an argument that I think modern human behavior was also present in Neanderthals and it was likely present in Denisovans as well. So it's not something that's unique to us.